Lebanon's economic crisis has sparked a wave of fresh protests in the capital, Beirut. Banks across Lebanon have been ordered to close for three days. The move is aimed at preventing break-ins and hold-ups by angry depositors. Lebanon has seen recent incidents where depositors tried forcibly to withdraw their savings. On Monday, hundreds of... The latest woes have severely impacted the country's currency as well. The value of the Lebanese pound hit a record low against the US dollar in the black market. The Lebanese pound has effectively lost 95% of its black market value in the last two years. Experts say that decline was due to rising demand for dollars on the black market, triggered by the government lifting state subsidies on many goods, including fuel. The United Nations says four out of every five Lebanese are now living in poverty. The West Asian country is seeking a bailout from the International Monetary Fund in a bid to contain the crisis. For more on all of this, Wilhelm's correspondent Hadi Francis sent us this report. The situation in Lebanon is very unstable right now. Banks are closed. Protesters have descended back to the streets. The country is looking at a political void as politicians did not choose a name to succeed President Michel Aoun, who supposedly leaves his presidential seat in the end of next month. Also, the maritime border dispute between Lebanon and Israel over gas has not seen an end, and the drumbeats of war are soaring in the country. The Lebanese pound has reached an all-time low, 40,000 Lebanese pounds approximately versus one dollar, whereas it was about 1,500 Lebanese pounds versus the dollar in 2019. Around 95 percent of its value has been lost since the beginning of the crippling economic crisis.